learn to hear words with ball eight. Listen with care. I be the analog arsonist, aiming at your arteries, all seeing abstract, analyze everything, adding on, absolutely abolishing. Everything. Rochester police arrested a group of peop peaceful protesters at an anti-capitalist march late Saturday afternoon. The protest was organized by an autonomous group of people who, from all over New York State, and not Roch Occupy Rochester, as many media outlets have reported. Police used chemical weapons and aggressive physical force to assault protesters who were on the sidewalk and attempting to disperse. Despite never re receiving any actual orders of dispersal from the officers, many people arrested were working as journalists filming the protest. A, medic, a protest medic was also arrested while attempting to provide medical first aid to another protester. This continues the RPD's clear pattern of overly aggressive tactics and unnecessary arrests in general, and particularly in the case of peaceful political protests. Many participants recall the similarity in repression to previous incidences of police violence in Rochester. In 2009, repression of a anti-war protest resulted in 12 arrests and multiple injuries including two people sent to the hospital due to police brutality. This brutal incident has renewed the frequency, frequently made call for independent civil, civil <laughs> um, review board of Rochester Police Department that has subpoenaed power in order to hold the RPD accountable to the community. In the time of Wall, of Wall Street bailouts, escalating poverty and seemingly seemingly an endless economic crisis is clear that the idea of questioning our economy economic economy system and challenging the power of the one percent to threaten the RPDs and rule, and ruling elite lead to allow other another world is possible and the struggles for that world continues uh, so specifically as we understand it what's your main complaint with police and what have you heard from police about well as being part of the protest um, on the 21st um, we were peacefully protesting on the capitalist system that we're under that's hurting people and destroying our economy and our environment. Um, so we were just peacefully protesting and um, we were attacked. I felt like we were attacked. We were never warned that um, to disperse. And I was arrested dispersing. I was actually leaving the scene when um, I was I was placed under arrest. What did they do to you physically? Physically, nothing. Um, emotionally, a lot. Uh, and, and to clarify, you said this was not an Occupy Rochester event. It was right. an anti-capitalist event? Right. Is the right way to describe it? Yeah. Okay. Did you witness police uh, treating people roughly? Yes. In what ways? Um, forcibly, like tackling them to the ground. Um, pepper spraying them in the face. When handcuffed. When handcuffed. <laughs> and um, just, I was shocked that um, people were just being tackled and forced into businesses and things like that. And <coughs> it was just, I felt overly aggressive. I was body slammed into a table in front of a restaurant, ruining the restaurant owner's tables and traumatizing his young son. Oh, no. restaurant? It's a restaurant on East Avenue. Okay. Um, tell me about the incident again. Start from the beginning. What happened? I didn't even know I was being arrested. Just next thing I know, I got picked up and slammed into a table at a restaurant. So 
So you're saying police out of nowhere just slammed you into the table? Yeah, from behind. They didn't ask you to leave? Nope. No, they didn't ask anybody to leave? They didn't ask anybody to leave. They didn't give us any orders to disperse whatsoever. Because you understand, it's certainly not police protocol just to, to grab people and to start... It did. Leave. Oh. From behind, I didn't even I know I was under arrest. It, it may not be official proto It may not be official protocol, but it's established practice of the RPD. They do yes. it all the time. They're violent without any reason or without They're any warning. They're terrorists. This is far from the first They're time terrorists. this has happened. I was on the sidewalk. So so like, there was no what, order to what, disperse. What means did they have no to arrest No threat of me. arrest. We were merely attacked. After moving to the sidewalk, people were pepper sprayed and tackled at random. And it was absolutely unmotivated. There was no warning. No warning. It was as simple as that. Would you have left the dance? If I was told to disperse under the threat of arrest, absolutely. They told us to move to the sidewalk, we moved to the sidewalk. After passing the police line at the bridge on East Ave, they moved behind us, began to divide us, and then arrest us. Pepper spraying and tackling. I was pepper spraying the moment I got onto the sidewalk. RPD is going to spin this however they want, but the public needs to know that RPD is acting out of line on a daily basis. You might not see it over on East Ave and Park Ave, but if you go over to Norton, you go over to the West Side, the police act like bulldogs. They are not protecting servant shit. Also, uh, I was uh, walking away from, uh, from the scene and I was grabbed from behind. They told me uh, I was being arrested. I said, for what? He said, disorderly conduct. I said, disorderly conduct on the, on the sidewalk? What's disorderly conduct? It's my amendment right. You know, my first amendment. And uh, he says, well, well, we'll deal with that in, uh, in court. So I was placed under arrest while I was watching everybody get beaten Hi. down, Hi. pepper sprayed, and uh, I was pepper sprayed well, not actually pepper spray, but I got forced into where they dumped a couple of canisters of pepper spray out. And I was coughing and stuff, and uh, I was pressed under the rug. This is the first time I ever been to a protest where I seen police officers lined up and just shaking the canisters while we're coming down the street and with the bel uh, batons out, ready to attack us. It's very unprofessional. Uh, we wasn't violent. We wasn't doing anything wrong. We were just pressing our First Amendment right. I think that everybody needs to know this. I've been to protests all over the United States, and this is the worst protest I ever been to, where they ganged up on us. The other places, yes, we might have antagonized the police, but this, we did not antagonize the police at all. I'll be the big bad body rocking bomb, pay the boulevard, bully back. Better bring a bomb to the battlefield, buddy black beast. Bringing bottoms that boom, basically feel barriers, bewilder buffoons. Listen now to words that begin with letter C. Crazy character, constantly creating concoctions, catalyst of cannibalistic rhymes, conqueror. What's your name? Can I get your name? Yeah, it's Walker. Uh, what's your badge number? 479. 479, that's yeah. it? Alright, cool. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Yeah.